The patient on the table having his left knee replaced is Chris Ives. He opted for the surgery after more than a decade of pain and restricted movement in his knees that was impacting his quality of life. I just couldn't continue anymore. But I had severe arthritis in both knees. Um, and it was my choice as to which one would be replaced first, but it was inevitable they needed to be done. And, but I put it off and put it off and put it off. Using the robotic arm, the surgeons were able to make far more precise bone cuts, preventing damage to soft tissues in the knee joint, and to liaise more closely with clinical colleagues in the operating room. We're able to put in the same implant that we've been using for many years here. We're just able to put them in now with a lot more information and detail. Using motion sensors during the operation, you can further fine tune the position of your implants to make them optimal for that patient. The robot arm helps us to be able to make precise cuts with safe boundaries. And the outcome? I'm still walking very stiff-legged, but I, you know, I can walk now. I'm absolutely delighted and so pleased that I went for the robotic surgery because I was amazed at how quickly I progressed. I was expecting six weeks recovery and uh, the swelling, I know, is still, still there, still evident, but it was considerably worse. I mean, it would have been like that, you know, five inches between my thumbs. The Sussex Orthopaedic Centre is one of only eight in the country to be recognised for its care. Chris is hoping to take advantage of their services again when he has his right knee replaced. Mark Norman, BBC South East Today.